Good day everyone and welcome. Before we start, we have a disclosure. Please be aware of risk in the future trading. We will cover several uh, f uh, different automated trades. First, I want to cover the signal automated trade. The signal automated trade has five different automated trade. ATM, ATM strategy, full automated, pullback, re-entry. And they all fire almost the same signals. Uh, based on one contract on the last entry for, uh, f uh, for the ES, uh, we have 111 ticks from the last entry, one contract. Based on one contract, NASDAQ, 444 ticks. Based on one contract, YM, 120 ticks based on the last entry signal, not the whole day. At the moment for those uh, instruments, we have over 1,000 ticks based on the last entry signal. If you don't have money to trade all of them, you can trade ES, NASDAQ, and Dow Jones. The ES 100 take, the NASDAQ 388 takes, YM 100 takes into the profit. This is the first stage of those auto trades. We'll try a different auto trade called the precision auto trade. We only have one trade left is the 30 year treasury bond. Uh, one more trade based on two contracts. It's been taking a lot, a lot of nice trades, no losing trade. One, two, three, and four. Uh, on the CL three minutes, did very well. Most of them, they did two rounds today. One in the morning when we were running the other channel. And uh, there is uh, some of them, uh, we did go in the afternoon as well. And those are uh, mainly uh, some of them in the afternoon. Today the market was really nice trend. Uh, ES 170 take, beautiful trade. Uh, 1700 on the 170 take. Uh, 600 ticks CL, uh, ES 3 minutes. Uh, the NASDAQ we did go earlier today on uh, one round. Forget it, we cannot see it anymore. And then in the afternoon we went one more round. It was a perfect trade this afternoon. I saw that the market was trending on the NASDAQ very well today actually. So we started the trade again at uh, 1.30, which I have mentioned today in the room, that on a Friday when those uh, amateur trade in the first couple hours, they lose money, they go home. Then you have the mature traders, they've been around. They come in the afternoon around 1.30 because the market goes one direction around 1, 1.30. And this is exactly what we have done on this uh, chart. At 1.30, we turn it on at 1.37. Uh, turn it on uh, the the auto trade took a trade and snap a beautiful trend and it was 7840 again the auto trade is about timing knowledge and knowing when to dive into a trade or when you need to stay on the side so this one here today exactly what we have said today on the other channel at 130 the market goes one direction we know that we spot it we already done uh, very good in the morning and then in the afternoon uh, we had one trade exactly at 130 and there we go one direction 7840 so this is was a nice call uh, for today uh, on uh, on the Nasdaq ES 32nd 1100 uh, gold five minutes and the CL 22nd also did the two rounds today on the NASDAQ 590 is already done it and we've taken one small trade and then uh, we uh, uh, the YM uh, the NASDAQ 1100 uh, NASDAQ 3 minutes and then ES 28 second and the CL 4 range also the 4 range is very affordable uh, to trade the CL and it took a tr trade on the on the trading with the uh, trend and uh, reverse the market for the ti7 uh, it's a total different automated trade the ti7 have a different uh, uh, type of an entry uh, for every instruments and have a different type of filter also for every single instruments 
what works on uh, the ES does not mean it will work on the NASDAQ. What works on the NASDAQ does not mean it works on the YM. So this is a snapshot of some of the trades they still open. Uh, YM, uh, we have 2,000 uh, open. I'm not going to bring everything down. Uh, but we still have here, you can see it on the DAX, 6,680 ES, 3,350 YM, 2,000, 30-year Treasury bond, and NASDAQ, 1,000, and CL, 700. So there is uh, still a few open. Uh, today is Friday, and uh, we need to close all those positions. And it's uh, very easy to close position if you want to. You just go ahead and say close position right there. And it's finished. This is the second round in the afternoon uh, on those uh, auto trades. Uh, ES five minutes is still in the trade, and uh, we also activated this afternoon. But what happened? It took a hit here on the first trade, and then on the second trade uh, did very well. Also, we turned it on like the Nasdaq, and this one here now we closed it at uh, three thousand four hundred fifty. Um, CL five minutes. And then uh, we have a scalper and a swing trade. And we have, you can scalp the market or you can swing trade the market. There is a three different scalpers and there is a swing trade. And if you want to, there is a reversal auto trade in it as well. And this is the YM, five minutes, YM, 28 second, 2500. CL 13 range, you can trade. Uh, you don't have to trade all of them, but it all depends what kind of person you are, what kind of knowledge you have, what kind of risk reward you want to have. So you can go from a smaller time frame to mid size or to bigger time frame. Depends on your stop loss, your risk reward. It's a different person, have a different time frame. So he has 14 second, eight range. And most of the time, if we want to compare Let's say in ES 14 second to 8 range, those are two totally different uh, charts, but they are within a range. This one 1,200, this one 1,000. CL 55 second, uh, ES 3 minutes, and CL 9 range. And the 9 range did very well today. It was 4,000 on the CL. Uh, ES 5 minutes, uh, this is the afternoon ground. And the ES one minute thirteen seventy five, and the CL uh, three minutes did very well. It was twenty five hundred. Folks, that's all what we have for you. Wish you a really pleasant weekend to you and your family, and uh, we will see our member on Monday webinar. Thank you very much, and God bless you all. Bye for now.